You want to talk about money with me? <laughs> Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something about passive income. Let me tell you something about generating wealth. Let me tell you something about multiple revenue streams. Let me tell you something about the money man. Gary V wakes up every single day and he eats, sleeps, shits, bleeds. Papa me. You want to talk about working one job, two jobs, three jobs, four jobs, side hustles? You come talk to me. I'm not the money man. I'm the money guy. You want to talk about passive income? I'm going to passively whoa, whoa, set my whoa, balls whoa, whoa, on your... 640,000 coins to build the best possible squad. We got over the hump. I'm out the slums. Back, back in episode one, I had 40 bands to my name. That turned into 80 bands. That turned into 160 bands. Then 320 bands. All of a sudden, I'm the money man. Don't even think about commenting some BS. Don't think about commenting. Oh, Papa Meeks. Oh, I wish Papa Meeks. Don't even think about commenting. You know why? Because I can't read broke. I can't speak broke. I don't know what you're saying. Might as well write that shit in Japanese. Might as well be a manga. Might as what? well put on some hen. Because I don't know what the hell's going on. <laughs> and we're about halfway through the football season, yeah? So hopefully you've got a pretty good idea of how teams are going to stack up. So why not add a little bit of fun into the mix? Today's video sponsor, DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner of the NFL, is dishing out an amazing offer to all new customers. All you need to do is sign up using promo code MMG. Bet $5 on any football team to win and receive an additional $200 in free bets if your team wins. That's it. Literally any new customer who bets at least $5 on any team to win will get an additional $200 in free bets if your bet hits. And if you don't have sports betting, there's always DraftKings Daily Fantasy, another awesome way to win some cash this football season. And if football isn't your thing, basketball is right around the corner. DraftKings has tons of ways for you to get in on the action over there. So don't forget, download the DraftKings Sportsbook app now. New customers use the promo code MMG and receive $200 in free bets if your bet hits when placing a $5 pregame football wager. That's promo code MMG only at DraftKings Sportsbook and enjoy the rest of the video. We're officially at the point where this coin count is going to compound so fast that every single episode just blows your cock out of your socks. Next episode will be 1.3 million. Technically, it should be 1.28, but I know most of you guys are so dumb, stupid idiots. You could never understand that kind of math. That complex multiplication. 640k times 2. Oh, uh, those are perfect numbers. Oh. Uh. Got 640,000 coins to build the best yes, possible sir. squad. So that's exactly what we're gonna do, baby. If we take our 640k, we divide that by roughly 20 players we need for the squad. It's about 32,000 coins a player, which, by the way, could get us a great player at so many different positions. And for today's episode, I'm actually gonna go in reverse order of what we've been doing. In these other episodes, I was spending big on these positions I really cared about, and then kind of just hoping I could scrape by. I'm gonna try something different here. We call this living below your means, okay, for all you uh -huh. poor people out there. Kyle Duggar, the 82 overall, 13,000 coin. Our budget could give us a way better player than this, but I remember something about Kyle Duggar. At 85 speed, 85 excel, he was an incredible user. So I'm taking Kyle Duggar right out the gates as my user strong safety. Now I want you to take a look at another really good option strong safety as a user, and that's Grant Delpit. So Grant Delpit, 87 overall, he's 85,000 coin. So for 85,000 coins, you get two inches of height, two speed, three excel. Is that worth 85,000 coins? My thought is no. I think instead I can build a monster everything else and just dominate my opponent, even with the budget beast. So I'm going to continue to pick up some of the best budget beasts in this game. And then we'll go from there. Next up is Caleb Farley, literally the best 22,000 coin card you're ever going to find. If you've seen previous episodes of Double or Nothing, you'll know this card. But if you don't, this is an 87 speed, 86 excel, 6-2 corner beast. 
I'm so sorry you got to see the same players a few times over and over, but Eric Stokes, 86, 85, 6, 1. And guess what? Nobody has come into a game against me and just mossed me. It's I've never gotten done with a game and thought, shit, I needed better corners. Now, that being said, there is one expensive corner who is one of my favorite cards in the game. I know I sound a little hypocritical here, but Denzel Ward is so good. He's only 5'11", but I don't know what it is about this card. He just plays so monstrous. Um, Just like real life, dude. I love Denzel Ward. So I'm going Denzel Ward. So it'll be Denzel Ward, Caleb Farley, Eric Stokes. Then we got Kyle Duggar up top. My strong safety is going to be 84. Justin Reed, 85 speed, 6'1". Very solid for 40K. A little bit overspend there. And my true strong safety is going to be Talanoa Hufanga. Anybody who watched me last year knows that his silver was actually a beast. Uh, he made a really big play, I think, against the Rams this year. Uh, he's got a really good card. 84, 87 Excel, 87 hit power, and he's six foot. He's only 27K, which is still under our budget per player. An awesome cheap D tackle is 83 overall Mean Joe Green, 14,700. Easy. Dude, I literally know nothing about Carlos Basham. I don't know anything about this guy. But let me tell you about this card, bro. 84 speed, 80 block shed. The 80 block shed is so surprising to me. That's really high for a speed rusher. Said the biggest left end, but I think he's going to be an amazing contain man. If we play somebody who just sits in the pocket, doesn't move at all, this might not be the best buy, but if we face a Michael Vick, Lamar Jackson, Kyler Murray, he's going to be awesome. And at right end, I want 84 Calais Campbell. He's just huge, dude. I think because he's so big, 6'8", 315, I think he plays better. I don't know if that's true, but I've used this card before and he's, he just outperforms 84 overall so well. I think an outside linebacker everyone should use if you can afford it, which, I mean, come on, stop being broke. Divine Diablo, 49,000 coins. He comes with outside stuff or inside uh -huh. stuff. I actually don't remember which one that is. But he's got 86 speed, 85 excel, he's 6 with 3. He's so good. This card came out like when the game dropped. A super nice card, thanks to the Legends promo. It's not the 81 Thomas Davis. He is good, but this one, the 85 overall Thomas Davis, 84 speed, 83 excel, 6 1. Super well rounded linebacker. And honestly, this is an amazing point to save coins. This Kyron Johnson is actually such a nasty linebacker. Tackle is okay. His block shed's not much. So if you send him off the edge, he's probably not a monster, but and you could use him. He'll still make tackles. He's got good speed. He's not going to get outran. I'm still using this card. Middle linebacker, I'm getting Isaiah Simmons. He is such a beast, literally no matter what price you're looking at. 11,200, sure. And for my other middle linebacker, I'm going base for you, Saddle Luakon. 8,000 coins, monster. Yeah, everybody knows about the GOAT, bro. So we've taken a totally different route with this episode. I filled out the defense and I still have 380k to use on just the offense. So you can bet your ass we're getting some monsters. Let's take a look at what the lineup looks like right now, though. We're also gonna have to sub out Ted Hendricks because it's gonna do this every single time. We're already a 75 overall. This defense is sick. Do gotta make some adjustments though. Denzel Ward, Eric Stokes, Caleb Farley. Feel great about that. Then my D-line, Minjo Green, Calais Campbell, Carlos Basham. Probably should get a backup D-tackle. I'll consider that. Then Divine Diablo, Isaiah Simmons, Foyo Sadaluakan, and you should be Kyron Johnson. And of course, if you need coins, make sure to go to instantmaddencoins.com. They sell coins on every single platform. You can also directly buy players or training points. Buying limiteds and then quick selling them is probably the safest route, so I recommend that. This is a significantly better deal than what EA is going to offer you, and you can get 10% off when using the code MMG. That's instantmaddencoins.com. Just use the link in the description. 400k to spend on offense and maybe a backup D tech. Let's get cooking. First thing I want is a quarterback, and I know exactly who I want. 87 overall Ryan Fitz Magic. Now I know this is a meme card, but dude, his stats are crazy. He's got 88 throw power, he's got 80 speed. Okay, so he's crazy fast. His accuracies are excellent. This is gonna be a superstar quarterback, uh, and hopefully he gets some good abilities too. I know he gets quick draw, but it's not really what I want. Now there's a lot of halfbacks that are good at this price, like a lot. But I want this DeMarco Murray because this DeMarco Murray is the only halfback at this price that's going to get this ability you see right there. That is goal line back. It gives you greatly improved run blocking in the red zone. I'm really excited to use it. And this DeMarco Murray, by the way, he's an elusive back, except he's 6'1", 220. He's huge. His truck is 83. His brake tackle is 86. This should be a monster card right here. You can bet your ass I'm bringing a Koye back to this team. He is going to be the best fullback at this price until we have 
like until uh -huh. next episode when I have 1.3 mil and I get a better Okoye. Now I know there's still a lot to worry about, but I am not going cheap on O-line. I'm not going to spend over 30k on each, but I'm not doing 80s. We're going 84s minimum. Gary Zimmerman, Alan Fanica. Thanks to the Campus Heroes promo for keeping stuff cheap. David Andrews, Chris Lindstrom, 33,000. I'll take it. And finally, Lane Johnson. That gives us a full 84 plus overall offensive line. We have 80,000 coins left. I have not touched tight end, wide receiver, or backup D tackle. I really do not care about backup D tackle. Daquan Jones. Beautiful, baby. My man beating wide receiver is going to be none other than... Oh my God, he doesn't have on the auction house. Damn it. There's an 84 overall Scotty Miller who has 86 speed. Why does that happen so much? Is there a Valdez Scantling? He does exist. All right, so Valdez Scantling does basically the exact same thing. 86 speed, six foot four. Really fast, big ass wide receiver. So he's going to be man coverage for us. And at tight end, I'm taking this OJ Howard. Six foot six, 250, 85 speed. Beast. That leaves me just a little bit of coins. I'm going to pick up two more wide receivers. Honestly, Chase Claypool is a big body. He's got a gold that should be cheap. 3,700. Awesome. That works for me. Do we have enough for Anthony Schwartz, baby? Anthony Schwartz. 1,300 coins. This guy's dirt cheap. 84 speed. <laughs> Actually, I, I have one final Hail Mary. Someone a little bit better than Schwartz. Kadarius Tony, 3,900. Oh my God, I'm the money man. I got 600 left over. I'm yes, so sir. ready to up. Yes, Let's go. Hey, this Kadarius Tony. I think I used this maybe in the first episode. Really good though. 84 speed, 84 excel, 83 agility. That's like a really, really solid budget wide receiver. All right, boys. Let's throw in our best lineup. See what overall we got. 82 overall squad. Interestingly, we did not go up that that much from the 320k episode but i can confidently say the team is so much better it's really because i spent all my big money on our star players maybe we spent 80k on demarco murray 80k on fitz magic big coins on our offensive line too i think with this team we can realistically do everything i can run the ball i can pass the ball i can play excellent defense my d-line is great we can stuff the run we can stop the pass i love this team so ted hendrix if you don't get your if you don't get your guatemala I love this team, dude. This team is actually kind of stacked. We're finally getting the point where my team's kind of stacked. All right. One thing I can't forget this time around is to actually give some X Factors to some players. So let's see what Fitzmagic can get. So he's got Quick Draw over here. Nice. He could get Identifier, which I actually would like. And there's no point in wanting one of those, so I won't. But I will go Run and Gun. He's got 80 speed. He actually could be a really good Run and Gun quarterback if I can activate it. DeMarco Murray. So baked into the card is this ability I was telling you about. Goal line back. Stronger run blocking within five Five yards of the end zone. I think I said red zone, but it's within five yards of the end zone. Either way, that's a very good ability. This shit's awesome. I can also give him jukebox. I feel like that's gonna be pretty good. And I'm actually gonna give him Homer in hopes that we get the home stadium and then freight train. If you can activate freight train, you can do anything. You're gonna win the ball game. Other abilities, I'll go OJ Howard. And I'm actually just gonna give him Vanguard just as an X factor in case we can activate it. One thing about Lindstrom is he can get post up, dominant when engaged in double team blocks. It's an amazing ability. And I believe being an 85 five overall is the cutoff for that. Like, I don't think Fanica even gets the option. He does it. I'll keep that in mind for future episodes. I would definitely like to have an 85 plus overall offensive line so I can give everybody post up. Everybody that I want anyway. But Lindstrom having it is pretty damn good. Denzel Ward's getting universal coverage, flat zone KO, and Homer. Listen, you don't have a lot of good players on your team. You don't got anybody to give abilities to, so. But you didn't have to say it. We can give a few more to Divine Diablo, too. I'm going to give him on the ball. France improved reactions to runoffs, and I'm good with him. Justin Reed is also going to get universal coverage. That's all we need for him. All right, gentlemen, with an 83 offense, an 82 defense, and an 82 overall, we're ready for the ball game. Fitzmagic, DeMarco Murray, Divine Diablo. What do you got, baby? What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? Sauce Gardner, Keyshawn Johnson, Randy Moss. I thought it was going to be a Jets theme team, and I was like, no way. It's uh -huh. just that those don't exist. Now, honestly, I believe we could do anything effectively here. Let's just go see what we want to do. Let's check down first play. Just get a reception under our belt. Beautiful. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to have my most perfect game. I'm just going to, I'm going to make no mistakes. I'm going to make perfect reads. That's what today's going to be. Perfect read. Let's go. Kadarius Tony over the middle. Oh, I can see his user. That's so nice. Dude, this guy, Ogletree, is getting so many reps. I got to start buying backup tight ends, bro. This dude, Ogletree, is always in. All right, halfback to Marco Murray. Nice catch. It's fourth and three. I'm handing this ball off. I can't fuck up. It's the perfect game. I can't fuck up. <laughs> oh, one mistake. It's still a perfect game. Still a perfect game. Nobody saw that. He started with ball. 
We know he's passing. We're in 3-4. We got Divine Diablo. We got Isaiah Simmons. We got so many studs. It's still the perfect game, baby. Come on, sir! <laughs> That was so fucked up. No, you did not just do that to me on my perfect game. Dude, I, I was in perfect position. That's why you have to use safeties, ladies and gentlemen. Because linebackers are incompetent. All right, Kyle Duggar. Come on, baby. Nice tackle. Kyle Duggar is a menace to society. Come on. That's why we put Duggar in for my perfect game. Oh, Kyle Duggar. Kyle Duggar. Oh, shit. I oversold that like crazy. Let's go, baby. Nice ball. Perfect game. They love to stop the perfect game. Unfortunately, they can't stop the perfect game. Kadarius. Oh, shit. That's P.I. Sir. Oh, I own you. I own you. Yeah. Yeah, you lost the dick out of me. I lost the dick out of you. Valdez, get in. Ooh, I dove. It's fourth and goal. I'm running it. I'm running it. We got goal line back. I'm running this football. Fourth and goal. Let's go, DeMarco. Get in there. Too easy. That's why you need goal line back right there. Wow, what a play. I don't know if goal line back activates on a two-point conversion. I assume it does. So I'm gonna try again. Nice play. Oh, just yes, kidding. Sir. You're shit. Eight to zero. Eight to zero. Oh, I dare you run the ball on me. You can't run the ball on... Come here. Come on. I just flattened you, Russell Wilson. Should have been a fumble. Don't you dare. Throw hat back. Throw hat back. You're scared. <sighs> Keep hitting him, boys. He's gonna fumble. You know he's gonna. Dude, what's crazy is my team's actually good enough to where I can almost run a little bit of man coverage. Yes, sir! I can't believe I just got away with running man coverage. Go! Go, 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 go! I should've just gone with Kyle Duggar, huh? I think I had it with Kyle Duggar. Shouldn't've done that. All right, looking for DeMarco out the backfield. Ooh, that's a bad pass. Bad pass. Howard, get up! <sighs> You know, actually, I'm going to punt. This is actually a very good scenario to punt. So I'm going to do it. I never punt. Got it? Dig, 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 dig! Duggar! God, you're ass. You're literally ass. Uh, wait, no way. <laughs> Self-fumble touchdown! Self-fumble touchdown! Uh, oh, my God! That was so sick. Three interceptions for Duggar. What did I say to you all? What did I say to you all? I said, I'm going to spend nothing on my strong safety user because he's that good. Look, unless you got 10 bill in the bank, get Kyle Duggar at your user. Ooh, bunch verticals. I think... I think bunch verticals just tears up this zone. I think Howard is wide open. I'm not going to predetermine because I think Claypool is going to take the user. Claypool. He doesn't go on Claypool. Damn. We could have a massive lead here. Oh my God. He just activated Vanguard. Wait, holy shit. He activated Vanguard. Everybody's activated. You're so fucked. Oh, well, the ability is Vanguard, not double me. Tough. All right. Keep this simple. Let's run man. Let's run underneath. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> why do I do this? Wait, we can stop him. We can stop him. <sighs> Ah, let's go! What a tackle! None of your swerve shit's working on me. Nice ball. It's going with the handoff. Damn! It's DeMarco Murray of his own. You know what? Really good play, good scheme. And he's going for two himself. Ooh, I love this. Don't you dare run that ball again. Yeah, that's what I thought. Try that shit on me. Right here. You're gonna throw right here. Oh, let's oh! House it, Denzel! Good block! House it! Don't try that shit on me! Take your one! Now it's a 10-point game! You don't got nobody! You don't got nobody but yourself to blame! Talk to him, Denzel! Don't run tight end attack, Russ, because you're gonna try and throw to your halfback, and I'm gonna pick you off. Man, oh man. You know, I tried to tell him. I tried to tell him that Kyle Duggar is the shit! Where'd you come from, 81? Where'd you come from? Shit, I lost this ability too? Did I lose it after halftime? I must have lost it after halftime. That's a bummer, but Howard is in. I gotta get up to zoned in. Great play. Come on! Let's go, DeMarco! Oh my god, look at how close we are to that. Look at that momentum bar. We're tickling it. Overcommit. OJ, got him! Dude, his user overcommits every time. Let's go. Wait, so I think I'm reactivated now. We're reactivated. Good ball. <gasps> He was just about to unload to a wide open tight end. But I sent a corner blitz and that's who got there. It was Denzel Ward. Dude, Denzel Ward, I'm telling you, bro, he's a monster. Shit, shit. Went to the wrong one. Oh, he's got Jonu Smith. He's, dude, he's got his own double or nothing squad here. Shit. He knows what hit him. Come on, come on, come on. Goal line stand. Russ got four interceptions looking like a true stat line. Oh, this is a run. Shit, it's not. Oh, I was so close. Bro, run that back, dude. Go look at how close I was. Wait a minute. If he gets this, it's an eight-point game. It's got to be a pass, right? No way he runs a football. No way he runs a football. Absolutely nothing. Completely boxed like a fish. <laughs> Denzel Ward with another one. Let's go. Keep it a 10-point game. Okay. Good blocks. <sighs> oh, he's so tired. He's fucking gassed. Canarius thought he was so gassed. Why was he 
he so tired, bro? Damn. He was so tired. Acting like he's been doing something all game. He hasn't done shit. All right. Well, we got Vanguard over here. Great blocks. Great blocks. All right. That could have been better. That could have been better. I should be able to run the ball like so effectively. He's not bottling that though. He Ooh. is bottling that though. Shit. My perfect uh -huh. game. Second and 12 throwing a heater at this man. He's got nothing to throw. Even if he got that off, you're probably picked. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You know I'm pitching that shit to Tyler Noah. I had to teach his boy a lesson. I had to teach him a lesson. Let him know he wasn't actually in it. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, I have jukebox. I have jukebox. I always forget that I have jukebox, bro. I was wondering why that juke animation was so nasty. Mmm. All right. All right. Third and five. Damn, I really can't get it going on the ground. At least not effectively. Two. Tony. Two tap Tony. Damn, is Randy Moss as his X Factor? Nice play. You wouldn't make that play otherwise. Uh -huh. Shit! Come on, I know what you want. I fucking own you. I own you. I own you. I don't own you. How did you complete that? Come on! <gasps> what the fuck? I just got dunked on. Literally. Good lord, don't let this be a close game, man. 22 to 19. Oh, you're gonna leave inside zone? I love that. You haven't left this all game. Let's go! First down. Can't touch the halfback, baby. You can't touch him. Love that, DeMarco Murray. I got you with this last time. What if I got you with it again? Come on! Right at me! Let's go, DeMarco! Not a good average, but he has come up big every time we need him. Where's that spicy man coverage? That's not even man. Nice work. Second and three. We're putting another touchdown in. Beautiful route, Howard. Love that. I could end the game here. You know, I could just kneel it out, but I'm on a, I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission! I'm on a mission! Howard! Why did you not... I just did a rat catch and he fell over. Why did you do that? Don't uh -huh. fucking hit the orange justice. Don't hit a Fortnite dance, bro. You just had a touchdown and you sold it. Say it. Cut it up. They make it too easy with goal line back. Look at those blocks, man. Hopefully our opponent plays this out so we can see the stats at the end of this one. Wow, that was game was a little too spooky for comfort. But a dub may be a dub no matter what, right? 28 to 19. We kind of squeaked that one out. We played, uh, played a little sketchy, but I had a great time. That's all that matters. The money man's here. All right, player stats. Fitz magic. 14 for 23 and two interceptions. Somehow, Russ, with five interceptions, has a 102.2 QBR. Like, I know he threw for more yards, but DeMarco got it done. But he was uh -huh. so dog water. In fact, really, my opponent's defense was just really good against the run. It was my defense that won us the game. No question. I really didn't do that much on offense. Howard was solid. OJ Howard was solid. DeMarco Murray was okay. Dude, like look at my stats i don't really do shit i played defense today that's what i did though but if we take a look at defensive justin reed five tackles talanoa hufanga six tackles divine diablo with an interception four interceptions for kyle duggar i love this team dude i'm sad i'm sad that after this episode i gotta get you know, i gotta lose this team i'm kind of sad about that if anything you know what i should have done after like you know hindsight 2020 but when i think about that game i should have spent even bigger on defense dude like i played such good defense i could have just gone balls to wall on defense i mean my offense just dog water and said whatever who cares but all right boys hey i love you thanks for watching as always you guys are studs i'll give you a switch on the lips next time i see you that's it hey take care y'all peace